Hey everybody, this is Rido, and we are back to another recording of Hearthstone. Now, we don't have anything really to do, so normally this might, this type of recording would be an arena run, or maybe we could think about something else to do. Uh, let's see. If we were to try Heroic, I, have I done all of Nyxramas on Heroic? Uh, I think I did. Either that or I didn't do any of them. That seems like a little strange to do. Let's look at this. I'm pretty sure I didn't do any of these. Hmm. So, let's try this. I mean, we rarely have any reason to go back to the next round. Anubricon is one of my finest spider lords. Good let's luck. Just try our deck. In 2015, after the Grand Tournament, let's try it against a Heroic Nexramus deck. We'll play our Custom Priest and see how this works. It probably won't work very well. Anduin versus Anubrikan! Normally Welcome for these guys, we would need to. The light shall bring victory. We would need to make a very custom deck and try multiple, multiple times. This guy is gonna be at 45 to 30, and I've got nothing I can play. So I'll end my turn on the first move. His ability is to summon a 4-4 Nebulon. This is, deals three damage to your hero. Let's see, we'll heal this and end the turn. Job done. Not getting very good cards, considering. Nox is ours. Looking at the Hearthstone deck tracker, just to make sure it's working. The out. Ready. Job's done. Finally get a guy. Ready. Shade of next round. Really, come on. Here we go. This in the light plus this. Turn. So, Nebulon. What's weird is a 4 4 Nebulon is summonable for the rest of the game, but it looks different. Hmm. Let's see if we can power this guy up. Increase in our health if we're gonna take them out. Hmm. Wait. We can do this if we plan this just right. We, won. we attack here. That heals this by four. Then we heal this, and then that does four damage there, four damage there, and we've lost. Oh man, I needed to have been able to play this, but really close. Interesting. Let's try this again. What we do? Of course, what I should be doing 
instead of wasting time is I feel like that felt like a bad thing and it did get us some experience I think but what I should be doing instead of wasting time is playing on casual that way I can get some gold built up but this is an interesting diversion to do while we are still holding back Android. from doing arena this runs while trying to catch up to 5,000 gold to my if I had just gotten the one of these cards victory. it would have solved what I was trying to do last time hmm. so here we have two Valen's choice immediately How can I heal? Thanks, I have life. to hit this guy in the face and then heal him. Job done. Like that. For so if this guy, here's the Nebu our Weblord versus the Nebrian. Interesting. <laughs> Up it goes. Thanks. Five. Is In two turns I can play this and kill them all. So we play this here, then we play this here. In the light's name. That gets it to a nine. Next turn, I play this, it kills them all. <laughs> Leaves them a couple spiders. Do it. Face the light. There we go. So, this is definitely a, a battle which I considered close to impossible uh, when it first came out. Let's see, we'll bring this guy out, summon this, that way he heals this, and then activates this to heal this, to activate this, which is good, and then hit that. So it's pretty obvious which card I'm going to play next turn. Hmm. Ooh, he froze my guy. That's no fun. Hmm. Well, I've won. Actually, I could have used the heal once, then use the shadow form. No will needed. No will the reason needed though. Fine, I'll want. So yeah, this is. I think. Irrelevant. You'll never defeat the Grand Widow. Faelina is training acolytes to worship me. Her job is very important. Do not disturb her. So yeah, let's just, for this episode and in the future episodes, why well, I just don't have anything really to do, we'll sit here and we'll play some of Nexramus and then, what was the other one? The Great Mountain? Anduin, the I fist can't even remember what... The other single player was. Uh, My acolytes serve me without question. The light shall bring victory. Those two are too early. Hmm. 
Nope, none of those cards are good. In my turn. So her ability is fire a missile for each card your opponent's hand. Interesting. And it only costs one. This is not good. Slay them in the master's name. Hero has plus three attack on your turn. Wow. Worshipper is not a card that actually ever made it into the general the actual card. A bunch of cards are like that for next Ramus and the widow I feel me. like they should come back and fix that at some point. Ooh, this is not gonna work well. That they should I don't know make a nerfed version of the worshipper that would work. Uh how many fingers do you see? Do something well along that lines. Because they have the arts here, they have the audio here. It's silly that they wouldn't bother to. Uh, Let the pain speak to me. Use it in some way. And I could really use that. That attack that does two damage to everybody right about now I've lost the best I can do is just take out some damage in the end of the turn she'll use this attack she'll do nine to my face I don't know if I have anything more to talk about today. It's been yet another slow day. Been distracting myself and not focusing. Uh, much like a conversation I have had in a previous episode recently, I'm not very... I'm not perfect without having a project manager either. Without having somebody look over my shoulder my and at least a little bit. The light shall bring it's victory. easy for me to slow down and not do as much as probably I probably should. Not that you have to work 100% of the time. That will just burn me. people out. But you do want to try to get a good 8 hours. And well, for YouTube, I try to get 10, but I don't really get that much, I think. <sighs> that sucked. wonder why they wanted to kill the Light Warden so badly. They didn't. They just wanted to injure this guy. The damned stand ready. Slay them in the master's name. This is so overpowered, this card. Of course, if I had just a really powerful taunt type deal. Go ahead and do this. And go ahead and do this. And my fate is sealed. What does this do? Deal three damage to your hero. My fate is sealed. Now Start with that. Right. And then we'll end the turn there. The widow embraces me. can I do? What can I do? Let's see. Heal this. Double this. Why did I double that when I could have done this first? Hmm. 
My fate is sealed. I will play that again, I suppose. Oh man, I'm not succeeding. I am not succeeding with this deck. Maybe we should try like the mage deck. I would think you'd want a pretty fast taunt deck for this. Honestly, it's... If I had one more mana, I could have used that. My fate is sealed. Job done. That just draws a card for me, so in that turn. There. In a lot of ways, playing this, uh, the heroic characters on next round, this is just a huge waste of time in almost every way. It gets your card back, I believe, if you get every single one of them defeated. We'll try the mage. Yeah. But it is a little quicker than playing against uh, other people. Glad to see the Hearthstone deck tracker is automatically detected on mage deck. You asked for it. So my mage deck, I believe, is just nothing but spells and spell power stuff. So doing 45 is in going to be even a larger challenge than winning by default with the mage deck. All of a sudden she played a different character too. I don't know if her cards are random or not. Next thing we want to do, I believe, me. is split this damage. Alright. Six damage to the face, two to him. Darn it. Oh well. There we go. Join me. If we could keep that In kind of pressure death. up. That would be something. But now I don't see how we could. Not with this one. You have failed. Failed. Hmm. So that. Still have this guy. Oh man, if I had killed this guy, I, he would have killed the guy next to him anyway. Should have read that. What is this card? Necro Knight. Another card that's not actually in the game. Uh, and if, they need to come back to these cards. They need to introduce them. Uh, even if it's not like a big expansion, just... Uh, next, just throw them in. You've already spent the energy on them. Let's see. I can Knowledge do this. Power, and I know a lot. And I can do this. And I can lose. Well done. And then in the turn. Yeah, we're not really progressing. I'm surprised actually we even beat the first one. Yeah, sh and if I wasn't playing the heroic classes, I would beat this easily. Or if I tried to actually make a good deck. Let's see. Let's try the Paladin. Why not? Petting Mr. Bigglesworth, which is an in-joke for Nexoramus that probably makes no sense now. 
Fairlina! Hmm. My acolytes serve me without question. I will fight with honor. I don't even know what my paladin deck is now after the grand tournament rebuild. Uh, so if we've gotten slightly more powerful since next Ramus, it hasn't been hugely more powerful. It's certainly not the situation that I am coming in here and beating all the guys immediately. With no struggle whatsoever. Well, that was a waste of a move. Dead. Here we go. Muster for battle. Reporting for duty. For justice. Job done. Darn it. Darn the luck. Slay them in the master's name. If I can just get this dragon kin sorcerer out. Power flows for justice. Just don't kill this creature. And we'll do something pretty cool with it. We'll go ahead and kill this. Oh darn it, I could have powered this one up more. If I can make it to the next turn, maybe I can, can do this. Don't die, just don't die. Oh man. So that would have given it to 11. Doubling it would have gotten it to... 22 still wouldn't have been anywhere near needed what's necessary let's try something really stupid here let's try our pirate deck I think he, this kind of character would require some traps some major damage type things we know what they're she's gonna try and do she's gonna She's going to attack, so taunts, traps, ways to end the turn. I don't know if there are any actual cards that end the turn right then and there. Uh, things that give immunity, perhaps. So a pirate deck here is going to bring about some interesting stuff if we can survive. But if I summon anything here that with just one health, it'll use a spell ability. Hmm. Here we I think go. this oh, you can see the inherent unfairness of this hero ability. It needs to cost like three or four mana, not one. Here we go. Job done. Slay them in the master's name. Hmm. Even with the priest deck, where well, I could heal myself quite a lot, this is not good enough. Let's see. those horses Here we go. help a little bit. If I could silence these guys, perhaps play a very like high silence characters. That might work. Down to eleven. Just 
go ahead and kill you that guy. And in, in all of these battles, I'm struggling just to just to get it below 30, let alone win. Yep, and that totally just lost the game for me. Got it down to 29. Wow. The widow embraces me. So, for a second, just for a second, I was thinking maybe we would try some of this off. Uh, try some of this as something to do. He's a giant spider! The Black Rock Man, yeah. So I haven't gotten the any of these. Dwarves are enslaved by and if I can't do Fight the next Ramus one, the Fire Lord. then forget that too. I don't feel like we are in the right position for deck rebuilds. Uh, as I'm looking here to see it, all the cards that have two copies versus the ones that have just one. It'd be better if I was in crafting mode actually. So I could see the ones that don't have any on top of that. And there's still quite a lot of those. Uh, I suppose ideally it would be cool if I had Ten, if I could get up to 10,000 uh, gold, that would be nice. T spend 50 packs on just classic packs, trying to fill in the entire collection. Because there's still quite a long way to go. We we still are missing some legendaries. We're still missing a lot of skill. Let's just play casual once and see if we can win against the real player and then I think we'll just call this an episode this is a very strange episode this is like a non episode I, I've talked about nothing you've watched me play single player for really no reason uh, I must protect the one the light maybe shall bring victory. I should do something else. I mean, I need to think of something to always have something to talk about. I don't, I don't know what I would talk about right now. Uh, but I need some more episodes, so this is gonna be what it, what it occurs to me is, and maybe you can, as the viewers, give me feedback on this. Uh, let me know if you care if an episode is really nothing and you just want to watch me play four games or if you would rather me just not air anything for one day I mean because I could have certainly come on and just said uh, I don't really have anything to do or play so we're just not going to do an episode today and then there would have been a five minute video and that would have been kind of silly uh, so I, I don't think anybody really wants that but I don't know for sure here we go in turn Next turn, I think I'm gonna bring out this guy and then turn after that guy like this to inspire him. There we go. Afraid of the turn the turn. <laughs> well played. Is he telling me he's won already? I doubt it. Is this guy going by Luigi? Oh, that I can say something to unimaginative names. 
Come on. Don't call yourself Mario, Luigi, Sonic, whatever. I mean, come on, you can... Uh, Nathan Drake, Master Chief, come on. You can think of something more original than that, can't you? Even if you were a huge fan of Halo, call yourself Halo fan uh, 5 or something like that. Don't just sit there and... Well played. And there we go. Just don't call yourself just Master Chief or just Luigi. And of course, this could be a player whose name is actually Luigi. That's not an uncommon name by any means, but that's still incredibly uncreative to just call yourself by your first name. And it's incredibly unsafe for you to put first and last, or just first, or just last. That's as How many fingers do you see? Am I gonna win this? You can tell it's it's a lot slower playing against real people. Fine, I'll heal. In that turn. So I'll at least kill this guy if he attacks me with both of those. I don't think it would be fair to comment on other people's videos to go pull up like somebody super famous, watch them play and comment over it. I mean, I think legally you probably could get away with that. I just don't think that that would be the right thing to do. My thanks to you. Mm -hmm. Well, in the turn there, I think I'm gonna lose. <sighs> This is inherently probably why I might never actually get the max now. level for all the characters, because I don't want to play this game off of screen. And if I don't have anything to talk about, if I'm just struggling to do three recordings per episode, I well played. I don't even really want to play it on screen. Huh. I've gotten a terrible selection here. So, yeah, I don't think I'll be doing this again. Okay. Let me know in the comments if this is going to 
okay episode? I mean, I really didn't do anything and that's the problem. We really, really didn't do anything. Of course, once we get over the 5,000, this would have totally been an arena run. We would have gone into the arena run and built a deck and done all of that. But because we are still trying to get up to that 5,000, that's still an issue. So you can't make gold versions of these card bags, card bags. Play three matches against three players on the same local network. Interesting. That's an interesting card back. Acquired for completing all of Nexoramus in heroic mode. That's the card back we would have gotten. Uh, acquired for completing all Black Rock Mountain in hard mode. So those threes I could do. Uh, purchasing Midva, I could do that. Purchasing Magni, I could do that. Don't want to, it's not worth it. Purchasing this one. Quite for achieving rank, rank to play uh, June 2014. So when you start getting to these, sadly there's just no way to get these card back. So if you really, really liked some of these, like that's a good design. Uh, this is like acquired by participating in what? Let me move the Hearthstone deck tracker. Now I can read it. In the TCSPA or other college affiliate program. What in the world is that? Uh, it's probably come and gone. This you get for ranking level 12 in Heroes of the Storm. Uh, from Warlords of Draenor Digital Deluxe Edition. What is that? Warded through the Samsung Galaxy Gifts promotion. <laughs> Acquired with the pre-purchase of Black Rock Mountain. Can't do that. With the pre-purchase of Grand Tournament. Uh, acquired with participating in Blizzard events during 2014. Uh, acquired with a highest level finish in approved esports events. The Golden Celebration. That's an interesting one. So basically, the only people that have this card back won some esports. Uh, or got very close to winning. And then this one, Power Core, is for attending an approved esports thing. Yeah, so of the card backs there, only three of, of them I could get without purchasing some, then I could get some more. Uh, I don't know why I decided to look at the card backs, just because I really have nothing to do here so yeah let me again let me have your feedback on this this episode where we really did not a lot of anything I don't think we would do solo adventures and try heroic mode after sitting there and just kind of wasting time on it it's better that we play once we get back to arenas once we go get the now 785 gold left which is let's see four maybe five more recording sessions uh, somewhere around that then we will have be up to 5,000 and as of this moment I have not heard a peep about any new expansions for Hearthstone and I doubt there will be one we're in the middle of October I doubt there will be anything before Christmas or at most there will be something right at Christmas uh, but I doubt it which puts me in a great position so we just have to kind of drudge through this this spot so I feel safe and secure with 5,000 gold and then we'll go back to arena runs 
that's it for this episode. As always, I ask you to like, share, subscribe, comment if you want to, and watch every second of my videos. All that helps out. If you want to support me, you can click on my name right there. On the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. And if you want to friend or follow me on basically any social media sites, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.